After a year and a long year, certainly, without hugs and face-to-face -face conversations, the residents at Hebrew Home in Riverdale are getting the healing touch that only family can really provide. And even just looking at this warms our heart, but News 12's Alexa Farrell got an inside look at the in-person reunions like this one so many of the residents and families have been waiting for. There's something special about the human touch. She's like my guardian angel. <laughs> I love her so much. 93-year-old Gloria DeSoto is finally able to reunite with her granddaughter. They've been apart through the entire pandemic. I just like don't ever want to let her go. We love you so much. In June, the Hebrew home did a drive-in visit. Oh Our cameras were rolling as Gloria's family waved at her from their car. That was when she was only able to smile through a window at her loved ones. I'm just glad to be on the other side of the window. <laughs> Today, she can be a shoulder to lean on, sharing laughs with her granddaughter in person. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> it's just such a special experience being able to touch her, like, look, we're holding hands. The duo sat together, catching up on life and enjoying the company. These visits are so meaningful to everybody. On the other side of the window, mother and son, Michael and Joan Cease, enjoying the sunshine together. Fantastic. Just beautiful. It was really great to see my mom. It's been over a year. After months of cloudy days, the sun finally shining down on these reunions. Residents have been the source of great strength, but not having seen their loved ones has been tremendously difficult. For these families, despite the difficult times, there's always love through glass windows, FaceTime calls, and now in person. You can't see it, but I'm smiling really hard right now just to be with my grandma again. In the Riverdale section of the Bronx, Alexa Farrell, News 12. You can't see it, but you certainly can feel the love there today. And we shared that reunion over on our Facebook page. Right now it has thousands of views, so many of you reacting to this wonderful moment. And we'd love to see your reunions with your loved ones in nursing homes. You can share them right there on our Facebook page, even leave the video and pictures in the comments. And we always love to see and share those heartwarming moments. Now, there are some guidelines and restrictions for visiting loved ones in nursing homes. If the infection rate in is below 5%, a negative COVID test is encouraged unless you are vaccinated. If infection rate is between 5 and 10%, a negative COVID test is required. And if the rate of infection is greater than 10%, no visitation is allowed.